uh, one of the other questions that we had uh, that we got emailed um, that I think is probably applicable to a lot of us, uh, especially those of us that have physical locations, is how do we utilize something like Google Maps, Google Places, as kind of a component of our, our SEO strategy? Well, I'll, I'll take that initially. So local search has been increasingly emerging as a big area. Everybody here. So if you do actually have a business that's where that's important, one of the things that you can do, the first thing that you can do is make sure that you claim your local space. I can't tell you how many people I talk to who are completely unaware, not only that there's a Google Places profile, but there's all kinds of other directories where they have taken the opportunity to help you and create profiles. And my brother-in-law is an example, is, uh, so I guess selfishly promote him, uh, Sports and Spine Physical Therapy in Beachwood, but they had a Google Places profile that had been hijacked by someone and they had built some other content and that happens so frequently. So take the time to take advantage of these web properties that have been developed. And again, for you, again, add value. Uh, people are, I, I can't remember the statistics, I, you know, they're all in here, but I think at least fully a quarter or more of the searches on Google have local intent. Some of our businesses have local aspects to them, some don't. If you fall into the former category, take the time to develop local, local content, take the time to add value, and go out and claim those properties that have been created for you, whether it's CitySearch or Yelp or Google Places or Cleveland.com.